Hi everyone, welcome to Freezer Burns. As always, I'm your host, Greg, the frozen food master. And you're joining me as I eat my way through the freezer aisle one box at a time. Today, I'm reviewing this. It is the Orida Extra Crispy Easy Fries, Crispy Fries in the Microwave. Only $1 for this box. I'm ready to put it to the test, put it in this patented crisping sleeve technology, see if I can get crispy fries out of the microwave and into my belly. Freezer Burns starts right now. If you spend some time on Freezer Burns, then you might stave off the stomach churns. Greg's the frozen food master. He's best bud to your taste buds. Once again, today we are reviewing the Orida Extra Crispy Easy Fries, $1 for this box. What do we got going on here, guys? It is microwave ready in four minutes and it's supposed to be extra crispy. Zero grams trans fat here, golden fries, French fried potatoes, 120 grams. Directions, it says on the box here, easy preparation, six steps, six steps. Step one, lift black tab. I think I can handle that. Step two, tear off along dotted lines. Step three, place fries beside each other in a single layer, no overlappy. Step four, put top on box, silver side down. Step five, push top down into carton flat on top of fries. Step six, microwave on high for four minutes. Cook time may vary, do not overcook. Box is very hot. Nutrition facts, serving size is three ounces. That's about 36 pieces and that's 84 grams, serving about two. Quick math means there's 72 fries in this little box. Calories, 180, 70 from fat, eight grams total fat, one and a half grams saturated fat, 450 milligrams of sodium, but there is zero milligrams of cholesterol, 390 milligrams of potassium, that's interesting, 11% of your daily value, and two grams of protein. Okay, so as I mentioned, there's fancy directions. First thing, use the black tab. Let's open this up. I'm going to carefully pull this back as directed. Nice, clean perforation. Here are the fries. Smells really nice. I can see a lot of salt on the outside. It's coated on, on the outside. This does not look like a whole lot of fries. I thought it was supposed to be 72 fries. I'm not gonna count them right now, but uh, that doesn't look right. That looks maybe about 30 fries. So I've taken this out of the microwave. I cooked it for four minutes. Now here is the back that I was supposed to basically do like a press on so it's crisping on both sides. And as you can see, it's all warped and you know, I don't know, looks like a, like a piece, like a tank that got hit by a missile. Um, here is what we have here. I counted all the fries. There are 41 fries here. According to the serving size, it should be around 72 fries. So that's kind of misleading. I don't know what they were talking, small fries, big fries, whatever. There's 40 fries here. That's one serving in my opinion. Smells um, like a baked potato. Um, it clearly is not. It looks like a fry. It's not greasy. Um, I don't even see anything glistening here. They look like baked uh, French fries, but overall uh, looks pretty crispy. Yep, pretty crispy on both sides, but not super crispy like it's gonna cut the top of your mouth. You know, I hate that when it's overcooked. It looks almost perfectly cooked straight from the microwave in four minutes. So now the moment of truth. How does it taste? I poured all the fries here onto a plate. These are, this is, oh, two of them stuck together. This is a decent looking fry. I mean, actually from the composition, the size, the shape, uh, the thickness, it looks kind of like a McDonald's fry if I had to put it under the, you know, one of the big threes. Certainly skinnier than, um, than uh, Wendy's and certainly flatter and, you know, less gunk on it than Burger King. Let's see how this tastes. Hmm. Good amount of salt on it. Crispy. Let's see if I can, my mic can pick it up. Very crispy, but, but soft on the inside. As I mentioned, I hate it 
when you get fries, no matter how you cook it, uh, or if you get it served in a restaurant, when it cuts the top of your mouth, that's just not enjoyable. But I also don't like the big steak fries where it tastes like you're eating sliced baked potatoes. This tastes like a good French fry. I'm ready to get some ketchup on this off camera and I'm really digging uh, what it is and overall value, not bad. This is the Orida Extra Crispy Easy Fries, Golden Fries, $1 for this box. I was a little disappointed that on the serving size, it said I should have about 70 fries. There's only about 40 of them in there, but for a dollar, not bad for the serving. Not too greasy, great technology right in the, in the microwave cooking it. I give this a three star. Question of the day, what do you like to dip French fries in? That's the question of the day. What do you like to dip French fries in? As always, I'm your host, Greg, the frozen food master. This has been another review of Freezer Burns. I'll see you next time.